Okay, so this is where it starts to get fun. You have the hard work done, and now you get to add the extras, like the drips and the arrows and the little doodads that make your, uh, make your graffiti name look fun. So you can add some drips at the bottom. So if I was gonna do that, maybe I would go here to where my C is, and drips are just, you know, just some um, lines like that. And then of course, erase your little extras there. Mine don't erase so well because I did not follow my own directions and use my pencil lightly because I wanted you to be able to see uh, what I was doing. So, but um, that's okay. So you want to also sort of change the, the length of your drips. You don't want them to always be the same. So you can make drips all the way across the bottom if you want. Um, you can make an arrow. So, um, and the arrow does not necessarily have to go, you know, down like that. You can do an arrow that goes down like that, or you can change your letter up a little bit. This is where you can really do whatever you want. You can add some details like this, like slice off the ends of your letters and add some details like that. Um, there's a reference sheet called uh, Reference Sheet for Backgrounds and Extras. So take a look at that. That gives you some ideas. Sometimes um, you can add some little graphic ideas like a, a crown um, or a heart or some squiggles, anything like that that you want just to make it a little more interesting. So I have one that I made, uh, I didn't, guess I didn't make any arrows on this one. Um, but I made some drips on the bottom and even something as simple as adding a little line like that makes it interesting. So take a look at that idea sheet and of course use your own ideas as well. So I just thought this was kind of a fun way to emphasize and kind of make it look like an exclamation point, create, yay. So this is where you really can have some fun, take some time and add anything that can maybe designs and shapes that you think will make your name look more interesting and have fun with this part.